Forget Silicon Valley glitz and skyscrapers, because the tech enthusiast Elon Musk is building his future in an unexpected place, the vast open plains of Texas. Here, amidst the tumbleweeds and wide open skies, a new city called Starbase is taking root. But this isn't your average city planning project with trendy cafes or bustling boulevards. It's about pushing the boundaries of space exploration and building the future, quite literally, from the ground up. Towering starship prototypes and colossal metal giants reaching for the heavens will become a permanent fixture in the Texas landscape. It's a scene straight out of science fiction, brought to life under the relentless Texas sun. So what does the future hold for Starbase? Will it become the launchpad for humanity's next giant leap? A cradle for a new Martian civilization? Or will it remain a monument to Musk's ambition? Let's find out. Elon Musk's ambitions for Starbase are taking root in the unexpected location of Boca Chica, Texas. This tiny village, nestled at the southern tip of the Texas Gulf Coast, boasts a single dirt road, a handful of houses, and a whole lot of wide open space. Perfect for launching rockets, even if they occasionally end in spectacular explosions. However, Boca Chica is no stranger to hardship. A hurricane in the late 60s dealt a harsh blow, destroying infrastructure and stalling any dreams of development. But that very isolation makes it ideal for SpaceX's Starship test launches. Surrounded by water on two sides, the Rio Grande marks the border with Mexico on the third. So the potential for collateral damage is minimal. As Elon Musk himself famously said in 2018, we've got a lot of land with nobody around. So if it blows up, it's cool. However, building a city here wasn't always the plan. Boca Chica was a winter escape for part-timers seeking solitude. But SpaceX, with its sights on the stars, started acquiring land. Well, who could resist an offer three times the market value? Most residents cashed in, leaving just a few holdouts living next door to a rocket launch pad. As of now, the quiet solitude of the city is filled by the roar of engines and the occasional fiery explosions. In addition, SpaceX employees have replaced many of the original residents, some living in the existing houses, others setting up camp in a fleet of Airstream trailers near the launch site. Even Elon Musk himself spends time here, overseeing his dream project unfold. But Elon Musk isn't just about rockets. He's got a wild vision for a whole new city of Starbase, based on efficient and sustainable resources. For the construction, solar power will be king, with every building rocking a Tesla solar roof and power wall, basically making the entire city independent of the regular power grid. Imagine your house being its own mini powerhouse. Traffic jams? Not a chance. Inspired by his boring company, Starbase could be a city without streets. Think of an underground network of self-driving electric cars zipping you around town. Boring company tunnels could even become the main way to get in and out of the city. But of course, this whole sci-fi dream comes with some challenges. With a population expected to explode in the next couple of years, the current 30 houses and the non-existent water situation just won't cut it. Therefore, Starbase needs a fresh start, a real build-up from the ground up. So once the construction begins, will Starbase become a neon-drenched metropolis straight out of Cyberpunk 2077? Probably not, but under Elon Musk's leadership, it's guaranteed to be unlike anything we've ever seen before. Right now, they're testing their Starship rockets near Brownsville, Texas. The highway nearby, called Highway Number 4, helps them control who can come and go during these tests. But sometimes, it gets super busy with traffic, and when it rains a lot, the road can even flood. But to overcome this problem, Elon Musk has this big idea. What if they built an underground tunnel system, kind of like a super fast train, to connect Brownsville to the rocket testing site? That way, People could zoom back and forth really quickly. They could even start the journey right after landing at the airport. But there's a catch. Even though Elon Musk is a genius, he still has to deal with rules and laws. For example, there's a law in Texas that says everyone should be able to access the beaches. But the only road to SpaceX's launch site goes through one of those beaches. So when they launch rockets, they have to close the road for safety reasons, which can be a problem. Still, despite the challenges, Elon Musk and his team are working hard to make their dream a reality. They're figuring out how to build this tunnel system and make it work smoothly. And who knows? Maybe one day we'll all be zooming through tunnels to watch rockets blast off into space. Adding to this, Texas lawmakers made a special change to the law to let SpaceX close the road when they need to launch rockets. 
According to the new law, they can close it for up to 300 hours a year, and that might triple soon. This shows that the state is willing to help SpaceX. Apart from this challenge, there is also a threat from the local governments around Brownsville. However, Elon Musk knows he needs to keep them happy for Starbase to succeed, and he's already found a way to do that. Money. He recently announced that he would give $30 million to Brownsville, out of which $20 million is for schools and $10 million is for downtown improvements. This is a huge deal for Brownsville because it's one of the poorest cities in Texas. The economy there isn't great, so young people usually leave for places like Austin. But SpaceX has already created over 1,400 jobs there, mostly filled by locals. So we can say that just the idea of SpaceX coming has caused a rush of activity. Empty buildings are being bought, and real estate agents are busier than ever. With this, Brownsville could become a big player in the aerospace industry, like Silicon Valley for space stuff. So with some political moves, Elon Musk just needs to show that 200 people live there and get most of them to agree. And since a lot of them work for SpaceX, that might not be too hard. Apart from this, if SpaceX counts their staff living in the Airstream trailer camp as residents, they could start the process of incorporating Starbase today. Once incorporated, Starbase would have its own mayor, police force, and control over taxes and infrastructure. SpaceX would also have the power to remove non-company residents from the area, which doesn't sit well with some people. However, it's likely that those affected will be compensated fairly. Looking ahead, Starbase has huge potential over the next decade. It could become the staging ground for life on Mars. SpaceX plans to have many Starship vehicles, possibly hundreds, in the next 10 years. So of course Starbase would be where these vehicles are built and stored. There could be launches and landings almost every day, with super heavy boosters dropping from the sky and being caught by massive launch towers. All the technology and infrastructure needed to build a Mars colony would be developed and made at Starbase. It wouldn't just be rocket scientists working there. They'd need thousands of different workers to keep things going, like tradespeople, laborers, and office staff. It's pretty mind-blowing to think about. We might be witnessing the start of a huge economic revolution, maybe even the biggest one in modern history. That's why important people like Elon Musk are moving to Texas, because they can see the change coming. With this, we move on to the final phase of this video. But what you think? Is Starbase really going to be the future, or is it just a crazy idea? Let us know in the comments below. And if Starbase does become real, would you move there or to Brownsville to be part of it? If you enjoyed this content, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to be part of our community. Thank you for watching. We look forward to seeing you in our next video.